Hello, I'm here with my daughter, Helena, my lab helper, um, and she's made something she's really proud of and she wants to show us all. So Helena, what is this? You've this? made it with Duplo. Yeah, so I made this Duplo Lego you are stocking ever. for Christmas. So then, and inside I put this light and it see if you So hold on, hold up the stocking. So you've made a stocking, so there's your stocking, Shay. Oh, wait, wait. And go on then. The bottom, bottom. Oh. Okay, so here's a stocking shape. And, 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 and sorry, so what that, that light goes inside, does it? So you've made this, and it's got a light inside. And if you keep still, the light will turn off. And when you move... It turn, will turn off. It's a sensing light. So it's a sensor, and the light turns on when you, when you move over the sensor. Okay, so what we've got is a Santa trap. Oh no! <laughs> so the light turns on if Santa comes and puts something into this stocking. In, if I put it inside here, if mm. he uh, puts all the stuff in, then you see the light will turn on. Mm. And then the light will wake me up. So it is a Santa trap. <laughs> so this light is, it's an all-in-one PIR unit. So you've got a PIR sensor here. And just a set of LEDs and it's just battery powered um, <clears throat> and you've kind of been inspired to use light sensors in traps by doing them in Minecraft right no because you did well, you did do the tree trap in Minecraft with a light sensor oh yeah so then you've kind of thought about how you might apply that to making traps in real life right mm. obviously this one's not quite as dangerous because the, the one in Minecraft what did that do um, basically you, the, you like build a totally true nice tree or you just use a tree and you like dig a little hole under it you mm -hmm. put a light sensor under it you put some tnt mm -hmm. it's a redstone mm -hmm. and and then you set it to day when it does that so then when somebody cuts down the tree they'll go oh there's one more bit and then abs because the light sensor triggered this. So you're using a light sensor in this project too. That's that's really cool, Helena. So, okay, so there's your Father Christmas trap. Are you going to see, you're going to try and see if you can keep it till December the 25th and see if you can trap any Father Christmases? Mm, you'll need to be extra careful. You'll have to watch for the rum and the sherry on this Christmas time then. <laughs>